Welcome to the Premier TNC YouTube channel. Starting a business in Taiwan can feel like a big leap, especially for first-time entrepreneurs. It's natural to have questions and uncertainties about the process, but with the right information and support, these challenges can be turned into manageable steps. In this video, we'll share 10 essential insights every new business owner should know to build a solid foundation, from legal basics to practical tips. These points will help set you on the path to success. Let's dive into what it takes to start a thriving business in Taiwan. To begin, let's talk about the structure of most companies in Taiwan. A common approach is setting up as a limited company. These companies can be run by one or more individuals, including a leader who all act as shareholders. The key advantage here is that shareholders are only liable up to the capital they've invested, making it an attractive choice for new entrepreneurs. These companies are flexible and allow for future changes, such as shifting to a company with shares. However, it's important to note that once a company is structured with shares, it cannot be converted back into a limited company. Moving forward, choosing the right business activities is crucial for your company's success. When selecting these activities, it's wise to prioritize those aligned with your primary income source, ensuring you're staying within your core expertise. Additionally, certain industries, like travel agencies or forwarding services, require specific approvals before you can start. Therefore, make sure to seek the proper permissions from the relevant authorities to comply with local regulations and build a strong foundation for your business. Now that you've chosen your business activities, let's discuss finding initial capital for your company. In the past, Taiwan had rigid capital requirements, with some funders paying capital on behalf of others and later withdrawing it. However, the regulations have loosened in recent years, though spot checks remain. While there's no set minimum capital amount, the initial capital should be sufficient to cover your business's operating costs. Moreover, if your business requires a special license or plans to hire foreign employees, there may be specific capital requirements you need to meet. Next, let's touch on the importance of tax compliance and invoicing for your business. In Taiwan, maintaining proper records is essential, and this includes applying for general uniform invoices, which are critical for tracking transactions. With the ongoing digital transformation, many businesses are now opting for electronic invoices, which are gaining popularity due to their efficiency and convenience. This modern approach not only streamlines your processes, but also keeps you aligned with the latest business trends. As your business grows, managing taxes effectively is key to maintaining compliance. It's important to understand that regular tax declarations are required, but they don't always mean immediate tax payments. The specifics of your declaration will determine when you need to pay. For example, value-added tax returns must be filed bi-monthly, with taxable goods taxed at 5% and exported goods and services at 0%. Additionally, every May, profit-seeking enterprises need to declare income tax at a 20% rate. Furthermore, companies must report any undistributed profits in May, with a 5% tax on any surplus not distributed. And if your company acts as a withholding tax agent, you'll need to manage monthly or ad hoc withholding tax payments, depending on the income type and payee's tax status. Let's now turn our attention to employee benefits and insurance. For companies with fewer than five employees, labor insurance isn't mandatory, but labor retirement and health insurance are required. Be sure to comply with these regulations to avoid penalties. If the company's representative also joins the labor and health insurance, their insurance fee should be at least equal to that of the employees. Next, let's talk about budgeting for your business's success. The fees for services will vary depending on the type of goods or services you offer. Your firm will act as an intermediary between your company and tax authorities, ensuring fees are customized to your specific needs. Basic fees are typically adjusted for industries, customer usage durations, invoicing methods, and more, so it's essential to explore options that are favorable for startups. For this, consider exploring our registration and billing services at our office. Finally, as you embark on this journey, remember that Premia TNC is here to empower startups every step of the way. We provide a range of services, including company incorporation, accounting, and tax filing, to help you succeed. 
Our tailored services are designed to make the process as seamless as possible, aligning with your startup strategies. We understand the landscape of starting a business in Taiwan and bring our business acumen to every part of your company's formation and growth. By partnering with us, you can ensure your business has a solid foundation and a clear path forward. Starting a business in Taiwan might seem daunting, but with the right guidance, it's entirely achievable. From choosing the right structure to navigating taxes and insurance, these insights will help you lay the groundwork for a successful venture.